Hello Half Pints and welcome, my name is Kim and you're on my channel today, you're joining me for an episode of King of Thieves. This is going to be my Let's Play kind of series for the King of Thieves mobile game. I'm playing it on my iPad currently, although I do also have it on Android. I have two accounts. Anyway, to get us started, I'm just going to go ahead and get things building in my castle. So this is actually the second time I've started out. Uh, i give you guys a quick look at my defense there. It does pretty well, 12 kills the first time and uh, 8 the second time. We go ahead and find a, a different dungeon now. This is Nikki's dungeon. And I'm so good that I get the key on the first try. Now this, however, this confused me a little bit. What's my best approach? On that, up there, jumping over? No. Alright, let's, uh, let's, let's think about this for a second. Take a moment. Jump on there, off there, off the wall, off through the wall, and he's in for 1,800 gold. Let's go ahead and take the spin. For those of you who may not know, this game is actually a lot of fun. You can think of it as like a Clash of Clans, but it's not at all like Clash of Clans. But it has the same kind of premise. A little bit of a, of a pay to win at times, to a degree. But otherwise, you find matches like this. You have to pay to skip them and stuff like that. Uh, you have to use these keys to break in. You have a certain amount of keys, and you can upgrade that. I believe this dungeon, I am recording in a post-commentary due to uh, just the uh, software that I have to use. This dungeon wasn't too bad either. I was able to get a flawless, flawless. And when you get flawless now, uh, since the last update, you get keys back, which is cool. Got myself a second gem of the day stolen. That's very nice right there. Up to about 4,600 gold in addition, which is nice. Danny's dungeon. Now, this is one I had a little bit of difficulty with. So it takes one, two, three, four keys to get in. That's all right. We can do this. Got up there, and I was like, wait, what do I do now? I think I see it now. I think I see now where I had to jump. But at the time, I have to kind of like hit it between those two in order to safely get across. I couldn't do it. Uh, I got a little antsy right there. And he does have pretty decent upgrades on uh, on that guy. So he does he did a lot of damage to me. Um, I think it was like 20 damage each time I, I died to him, which was significant. I knew I couldn't die to him anymore. If you look right about there, there's a chance, right? Nope, that wasn't it. That wasn't it. Nope, that's not the, that's not the answer either. But if you look real closely, right, I, I fell down. I wonder if I'll do it again the right way. Right there, if I was up at the top. I, I think I think I know now, if I was to go back, I know how I could have done it. But uh, at that point, this died. I was like, all right, I could probably do it now. Nope. <laughs> fail, and then another fail. I, I do get it eventually, guys. I do get it eventually. I've, I've beaten uh, tougher dungeons than this before. But uh, for some reason, that kind of like a cross section right there was really really getting me. I, I don't know what I did there. I just decided I don't want to live anymore. Uh, <laughs> that cross section was giving me trouble there. So th this was the hardest dungeon of uh, of my play this morning. But So I'm down to zero health, which means I get basically nothing from it. Uh, if he had a gem, I'd have nearly no chance of stealing it, but he doesn't anyway, so it's not a big deal. Go ahead and get the 500 coins and a little bit of experience, which is fine. At that point, it's worth getting the extra p experience just just because you're not going to get anything good anyway. I said, you know what, I'll do another one. I have time, I'll do another one. So it takes four to break into that one. I'm like, alright, I got this. Jump, jump, off the wall, on top. How do I want to do this? And I sit here and I kind of think about it. Nope, too high. Jump too high, and they are too long. So they, alright, we'll jump, miss the jump. Okay, alright. I, I want to go faster. Oh gosh, that was bad. So I realized, all right, gotta gotta stall a little bit here. Gotta make sure he's coming back to me when I make that first jump. Not a big deal. Off the wall. Gotta jump around a little bit. Make sure there you go. He's facing away from me. Get the experience. Nice job. In for 898. And let's see if we can't get a gem from this. Hey, we do. Slightly less chance to get a gem. We do anyway. 150 uh, worth gem. Not too bad. Minuscule in comparison to my 640. Uh, but my lock pick capacity was upgraded now, and I've also leveled up to level three. Get some lock pits up, lock picks up there, I should say. Got my red demon upgraded level two too, which is gonna help with the defense side. So I'm like, all right, should I do something else? Yeah, you know what? What? We'll do one more. We'll do a. We'll do another one right here. So we can do one more. One, two. It takes two to get in. I was like, all right, I got this. Fail right there. Just nip the top of my head right there. I think I actually don't need to stop at all. I think I could have just gone one, two, three all the way up there, but it was a really pretty easy dungeon anyway. Sitting up there, just need to jump a little bit, and you're good. So I got three stars at that, and I land into the no-go zone. Contemplated a respin and said, eh, it's not worth it at this level. They're not, the gems aren't worth enough right now for a respin. So you go ahead and go back and decide, I need to upgrade something. 
Uh, currently, we have a 35 and a 25 going in there to be combined, and that's not very good. Got a couple things I can claim, a little bit of uh, experience and some orb things, and then uh, we're going to go ahead and check it on the league. I'm going to do this probably every episode so you can see where I'm at. I'm at level 12 right now, 12 in the league. Uh, I will be playing a little bit before you see the next one. I might even get up to the next league before that. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Go ahead and say, you know what, I have to upgrade something. Why don't we upgrade another uh, key? Because I believe that having a lot of uh, lockpicks is really kind of really helpful. And we don't have enough to upgrade any blades. So that's going to be it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that great, some fun stuff. There will be more uh, King of Thieves to come. I really do enjoy this game. And uh, go ahead and follow me on Twitter, 2% Skim. That's with the number 2, not T-W-O. Peace out.